One of the really cool features on Community Weaver 3 is the time bank is talents, which keeps a directory of all the talents in your time bank. So in this tutorial, I'm just going to show you how you can configure the time bank is talents to meet the needs of your time bank. So if you click on the gear wheel at the top and go down to configure lists, you'll then get a page which has all of the current categories for Time Banker's Talents. So what you can do is either delete ones that you'd no longer need or are not applicable to people in your time bank just by clicking these X's or you can click this big orange button at the top and you can create your own so you can either use this drop down menu to create a subcategory that exists under one of the main categories already so if you wanted a new category under education you could then make it up here and write it in the name and it would go under the education parent category or you can select top level category and write a new name for a new category that you want and then also create subcategories so if you're going to create a top level category like it just says here, you have to have at least one subcategory in that. And you can then select whether or not you want that in Time Banker's Talents. So you can, if you don't click this box, it will, uh, the new category will exist in the list of service categories for offers and requests, as well as Time Banker's Talents. And if you do click the box, it will only the category will only exist in the offers and requests section and not time bankers talents. So it's really easy to do that. And if you want to review which of these service categories are included in the time bankers talents list, you can just check or uncheck these boxes here. So that's one easy way of configuring Community Weaver 3 so that it fits your own time bank.